J drone here. Check it. Tello, 5.8 gigahertz camera, battery supply to power it, and uh, we got my controller here, which is, I believe, a game vice. I think it's a game vice. Let me see here. And my Maker Fire goggles. Let's see. Bam's out. Game vice. That's what type of controller I'm using. It's plug and play for uh, any Apple iPhone. Um, just plug in. Right in there. Uh, we're gonna give this a fly just kind of around my side yard and whatnot, and uh, there's lots of precipitation. It's probably gonna rain again, so I don't know how well this is gonna work, but stay tuned. All right, guys, really quick, quickly, what you are watching for this video. Main part of the screen is uh, screen capture. You're gonna see that freeze constantly. As that's freezing, look to the bottom left part of the screen. As it says, Wi-Fi signal lost, uh, fly closer to yourself, look at the bottom left part of the screen. The whole purpose of this video is to show you that you can control this drone further than the video quality is. Tello failed on not having SD card in this because the flyability of this drone is actually pretty epic. We're gonna go ahead and turn it up to the highest speed here. That way we can fly, we have a little bit of wind. Uh, I'm not going to jabber jaw through this whole video like I normally do. Um, the takeaway for this video, note the range, bottom left corner. Note the freezing, main part of the video. Um, and uh, I, I suggest 5.8 gigahertz in this drone to get your full capabilities of this. Hopefully they come out with a second one that has an SD card in it that you can fly it with the full capabilities. You can fly it with the range and not have to worry about the freezing up, which you see in the main part. And uh, you could actually get some decent video quality, which we kind of have in the bottom left corner, but it's definitely not HD. That's off of my goggles. We will crash a couple times here. I will do a range run down the road to show you that we can go past 100 meters. My neighbor will come up. We'll check out his dog and whatnot, but I'm going to pipe in music again. What you are doing, you are looking at the main part of the screen. When that freezes, look the bottom left part of the screen. And uh, you will see that I still have full control over the drone despite the fact of the image freezing, despite the fact of it telling me to fly closer. I can fly much farther away from myself. Control away from yourself up with this drone is well past 100 meters guys if you haven't subscribed smash that subscribe button if you're on facebook check out drone days the link will be at the bottom if you have any questions comments concerns down below type hit return i'll get back at you all right guys later